Welcome to the project demonstration of UVC disinfection system using Arduino and controlling through the Bluetooth. So here we are going to automation of this uh, controlling of automation of this UV light using this electromagnetic relay and we are going to controlling that relay with the help of Arduino Uno board. So Arduino Uno board will take the input from the two modules. One is the PIR sensor, this passive infrared sensor and HC05 Bluetooth module. So based on the input from this, we are going to control in that. And the input sections like, so when we enable the system for automatic operation through the Bluetooth module, then the Arduino you know, uh, will enter into the automation mode, then it will read the input from the PA sensor. Whenever the person presence detected, it will provide the high signal and Uniboard will read that. And based on that, it will switch off the UV lights. When the person is detected because uh, UV light will harmful harmful for the human beings and then when the person presence is not there then the system will initially switch on the buzzer and this red LED indication after that some time around of two seconds of duration then the system will on this UV light as it will indicating the audible and visual alerts that we are going to on this UV lights so when uh, UV lights continuously on then it will check for the PR inputs as well as Bluetooth inputs. So if the Bluetooth provide the input to switch off this automation, then irrespective of the PR inputs, we are going to off this UV light. And one more automatic off feature is there. So after a certain time of the uh, like duration, so like here we are programmed for around 30 seconds. After 30 seconds of duration, irrespective of these two inputs also, we are going to switch off this UV light. So again, when person comes, then the timer is going to be the zero and when he went off, again it will be on for 30 seconds or PIR inputs. So in between 30 seconds, if the person enters, then automatically it will be off. Otherwise, after 30 seconds, it will be off. And if you uh, disable the automation system through the Bluetooth also, then also it will be off. So for on, two conditions. We should enable the automation and person should not be detected. And for off, person detection and timer and automated automation off through the Bluetooth. So these are the conditions. So interfacing connections for the input and output modules. So PA sensor interface at 12th pin and a relay board at 11th pin and a Bluetooth module at 8 and 9 buzzer and this LED indication at 13th pin and uh, this is the regulated power supply board. So which will take 230 volts input from this cable and will provide us 5 volts DC constant power supply. So once we provide the power supply to the system here, it start reading input and output controlling. So this one is the UV choke. So as we provide the 230 volts input to this through this electromagnetic relay and it will control the UV lighting. So let us see the demonstration. Before switching on the kits, we need to install this bluetooth terminal application and uh, open that right so after installation you can switch on the kit so right switch on the power supply and then there is light indication on the inner board and on the bluetooth module also we will get the blinking one so here it's blinking showing like continuous blinking showing that it was not paired with our bluetooth module so mobile phone so initial setup in any new mobile phone so just go to bluetooth settings of your phone and in that pair with our device so initial to show here so if it doesn't show in your new mobile phone so just i'm showing like that so you need to search for device and it's a zero five so it will ask for a password initially right so done and after that go to the application so there in history we can get our hc05 once you pair from here see the blinking rate slows down on our hc05 bluetooth module so device is connected now and initially when you open this there is the icons like button one two three four so we created name so uv on so for that actually we need to write uv on and enter the command one so it's not showing like fully color so and you also de uh, deselect the these two so there are the selected one so like this so you should deselect them write uv on type one and deselect and save 
same manner for uv of also uv of and should deselect them so after that save that now the device is off state so when you click on this so it will be on initially so the uvl got switched on so when the motion is detected it will be off so if the motion was not detected right so it will get switched on till the motion detection or till you switch off that or till the time completes so if i switch off this this case and you be off so now it is off again again on this automation so on so there is a motion so if the motion detects automatically it will off and again motion not detects then after some time it will check for the and again on so before switching on it will inform to the person with audible and visual alerts right and again off from here right okay